My PhD has been using building thermography to look at building defects. Thermography or thermal imaging is uh, looking at infrared radiation with a thermal camera. When we can see heat, uh, then we can identify all the, the different defects or failures or um, maybe where the contractors miss out bits and pieces of insulation um, and then we can pinpoint uh, the remedial action to sort of solve those. As an architect, um, I was very aware of uh, building defects um, through practice, but as soon as you start looking at them with the thermal camera, you get a real good grasp of, the, of how important building defects can be on the thermal uh, efficiency of a, of a building. There's a, a need in Cornwall to improve the existing housing stock. The PhD was set up so that uh, we could use thermal imaging to pinpoint specific defects in Cornish properties. I've been working with RTP surveyors and the DCH group uh, down in uh, Penzance and they provided um, case studies for me to, to look at. At present, most thermographers tend to go around uh, and perform a walkthrough survey. I've been looking at uh, slower surveys as well as fast surveys. Time lapse enables uh, you to look at a building for maybe a period of 24 hours or one whole week. I've also been looking at the other end of the spectrum, so fast thermography, a drive-by thermography, so they're strapping the thermal camera to the roof of a car, like Google. Whilst you're kind of getting a whole load of buildings, sometimes you're missing defects uh, that you might have actually picked up through another survey methodology. The PhD has been a really useful step in, towards uh, setting up my own business and also pursuing further research in the field of thermography. Hopefully other thermographers might be able to use um, the, the knowledge that I've gained through my PhD to better tailor a thermography survey. So instead of just choosing the walkthrough survey as the kind of the go-to survey methodology, they may tailor the, the, the survey approach depending on what the client wants and uh, hopefully improve the thermal comfort for the residents so that uh, they're not spending so much money on fuel um, and have a much better quality of life.